and welcome. This is Melissa Armour with the Stock Swoosh reviewing the BAs. But so many trades call on this, you almost lose track. But there's, um, I think everyone should be out of the ones from this week's expiration for tomorrow's expiration. Uh, but very nice calls. And they're start these are starting to get more expensive. I will say that. Um, they're, they're very, they're interestingly enough, starting to get more expensive. Um, and I've noticed that recently, at least if you want to give it, give it a cushion. Um, which I which I wanted to do and someone had mentioned to me today. Oh, I think I got bad fills on this No, I mean these these ones here the new round ones that I called are are up um, Even at, at not a great price, but they're not up. They're not up that much So I mean it's really up to you if you want to get out of something before the weekend Then you can get out of it with whatever you're up if you're concerned about the weekend but again what I'm looking at this I'm looking at this to get a break of uh, you know, 130, 125, 120 would be the dream target even here. So again, this just is so weak and has provided so many nice plays, uh, day trades, puts, everything. I mean, and um, this really hasn't full on gone yet, to be honest with you. I mean, I've just timed this perfectly for the puts that I've been calling this. I'm continuing to do that as well. So even though you might think, oh, I didn't get a good price in this, trust me, if this makes the move, um, they will be very, very, very profitable trades. But if you want to play it safe into a weekend, you can always get out of something up a little bit of break even. I mean, occasionally I'll look at that on a Thursday, Friday and say, uh, you know, because in this market, it's very volatile and you got to be aware of that. And um, but but if you if you did these then you have to either have conviction or you don't have conviction, either you want to give it a chance to pay you or you don't want to take the chance. So I think you have to have to decide but just don't forget to be booking profits people it's very very important to be booking profits i'm calling so many good trades so many positive trades please don't forget to book profits you have to look at the date of expiration we're determining which ones to get in and out of okay and you've got to give some of these trades a chance to work okay and this is one of these ones here that i don't know why you wouldn't want to give it a chance to work is the point so we'll see where this goes i'll be watching it very very closely again it'll be interesting to see what happens between now and monday um, although there is going to be some action in the market tonight, I don't know if it's going to be anything significant. I highly doubt it, but we'll be watching. Good luck, everyone. Great job, everyone that's been doing these trades. Great job, everyone that's made a lot of money. This has definitely been the gap of the month for sure. Um, and we'll see where we go next week. Have a good weekend, everyone. If you're interested in the Gap Options newsletter, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. And if you want to learn how I read this so well since all the way back in December, 2019, then uh, you need to take the Golden Gap course. So email me at melissa at the stocks,